Yo my people, we're back again for episode 4 of this Crystal Palace FIFA 23 career mode. Now as you can see here, we have gone from professional to world class, 4 minutes each half and that as well, the weather's not looking too good as you can see. Um, we had some people in the comments telling me, try and you know, up your difficulty a little bit more. So I was like, you know what, why not do it? I've been practicing a bit as well and it's actually pretty interesting. I kind of enjoy it to be fair. So yeah, uh, hopefully, you, you may notice the difference in that, but yeah, hopefully it does make a difference in our play and you know, in the pace of the game a bit as well. Come on the Palace man. London Derby as well against the Tottenham. Another good save. I just need to do a lot better about shooting you know. It's not good enough. I want to try and aim for top bins. Go on, go on. We still got a boy. Go on. So, oh. Oh, Lloris again with the save. Man, we're all over Tottenham. We're doing really well. Considering we changed the game mode and that up a bit. We're doing really well. Go on, go on. Can't give Tottenham time and space. You gotta watch out for Harry Kane. Go on, Basaka, our position now, bro. Goal. Completely carved us open there. Completely carved us open. It's Kulosevsky with the goal. And we're 1 0 down already. That's their first attempt at the flipping game as well, you know. Their first attempt and they take it. Oh, go on. Oh, Larissa again with the save. What's this goalkeeper on? Oh, that's a terrible corner. Terrible, terrible corner. Two 0 Absolutely mugged me off. It's absolutely mugged me off there. Go on, Wilf. Go on, Wilf. Go on, Wilf. Edward. Yes, we're back in it. Two one. There's a chance taken. There's a chance taken. Not an Edward. That's his seventh this season in the Premier League. He's on fire for us. What a finish that is. Good bit of play from Wilf. He had to score that, didn't he? He had to score that. Look at this. Drag back there. Keeper had no chance for Tottenham. 2-1, we're back in it. We should be winning this game, but Tottenham just have the quality and we just didn't take our chances. That's the downside. Yeah, we're gonna get Eze on the corners. Both of them and that as well. And that's pretty much it. Apart from that, I'm just gonna keep it out of here. You know, we've been playing some really good football and that, you know what I mean? <laughs> We've been playing some superb football, but we're just cut out by a bit of quality from Tottenham. Edward, penalty. Is he giving a penalty or what? Yeah, he's giving it. He's giving it for a handball. We saw it look like it. It's handball. Say that. Come on, Wilf. And it is 2-2. Wilfred Zaha gets us levelled. Scores a penalty yet again. Brilliant penalty down the middle there, sort of. 2 all. Composed, steady. Look at this. Gonna get Richards off of Mitchell. Straight down the middle, actually, to be fair. It was, yeah, I sort of thought it was, yeah, it's straight down the middle. I don't know what I was, I don't know what I was on about now, I'll say that. <laughs> Edwards. Oh, what a goal. Oh, my words. What a goal. Oh, boy. The finish, the quality on that shot. 2 0 down, 3 2 up. Deserve it. We deserve it. We're going to take off Eze and bring Elisa on. That is a gem of a strike. That is an absolute gem of a strike. Look at this. Look at this. The quality, the finish. Absolutely. Brilliant for Montel Edward. What is that goal number eight for him? Blimey, he's doing better on career mode than he is in real life. That is a goal of the season contender. Go on, he's in again, he's in again, he's in again. He's on a hat trick. Square it to Elise. Square it to Elise. F oh, Edward, f shoot. For f excuse my language, man. Oh, bro, what was I doing? What am I doing there? Back to the keeper, keeper. Just smack it, bro. Smack it. There we go. Oh, I'm mucking around with it, bro. Good save, guy. Come on, Palace, man. Right, get Anderson off. We're going to get Chalabar on. Want to make, just let, that, let the sub happen quickly. Come on, Basaka. Stay in your box, brother. Free, free. That's a goal to concede. That's a goal to concede. God's sake. Kane, okay, good save from Gaia. What a save. Is it 3 3? Should have won that, man. Should have won that. All the hard work. 
Collins from 2 0 down to make it 3 2 and then conceding a sloppy goal from a corner the way I did. So that Edward goal was just quality though, I'll say that. Absolute quality at its finest. Got a few stuff coming through here. So we got the youth scout report and that or whatever it is and that. Yeah, um I'm trying to gonna try and sign um a few more youth players and that. I've got a few youth players coming through and that as well. Not not bad, you know. It's got potential this guy, Nick Richer. Sign him up, why not? I'm gonna sign this Adrian Craft guy, he's got a 92 potential, we'll sign him up as well. And yeah, well, let's get let's sign um Niles Shamida, I think that's how you say his name. We'll keep an eye on these other stuff and that as well. So that's pretty good going. We signed a few youth players and that as well. We send him to scout a few more players and that. I say we're gonna start our scouting network in France and that there. So we've got Manchester City in the Carabao Cup. We've already played City this season to them and lost 2 1. Still gonna be an easy game. We're still gonna give certain players, younger players, a chance. We've got Johnson in goal, Ferguson the left back, Chalibur and Anderson, two centre backs, right back Joel Ward, Gallagher and midfield and McCarthy. For SA still playing in Cam Sahar on the left, Ricky J. Jones up front for us and Jordan I. So, yeah, I'm not optimistic, um, but you know, let's give it a try. Here we go, Man City in the Carabao Cup 2 2. But City won 4 3 on penalties. Oh, what a shame, we were close though. We were close, I'll say that. Yeah, um, Bernardo Silva putting City 1 0 up at the 20 um, of minute. Um, 11 minutes later, Ricky J. Jones makes it 1 1. Phil Foden puts City back in front and Zaha gets the equaliser late on to make it 2 2. But City obviously win the penalty shot. What a shame, but we gave it a good try. It's a good effort. We are officially out of the Carabao Cup. With us dropping a few points, we dropped down to 8 with 16 points. We're still, what's it about? I believe two points here, as you can see, off the top four. We're not far off Europa League, Conference League as well. It's still early doors. City top of the table. Man United second. It's still tight up there. We've got Aston Villa next, who are currently, what, um, five points behind us uh, sitting in 11th and that so yeah it's not going to be easy in that um, but it'll, it's, it'll be a close one I'm confident for a win and a good result fingers crossed come on you palace bit of a sloppy start there getting the ball nearly good defending Mitchell got the ball here still Wilfred Zahak oh wow oh my word what a header. I thought the keeper was about to save that, you know, but it's a brilliant header. Quality from Zaha. Seems to be scoring with his head for fun now this season. Look at this. What a delivery from Eze. Edward ducking down out of the way. Zaha. Oh, mate, that is a gem of a header. Superb. 1-0. Question is, can we hold on? Been leaking a lot of goals this season and that. Yeah. Only kept like two clean sheets, I believe. And that was against West Ham and Bournemouth in my last episode. One thing I'm going to do at half-time is the squad's looking a bit ropey and I'm fit slightly. I'll make the changes in that as well. Come on, Palace. He's marking Leon Bailey. He's picking him up. Nearly went and scored there. Jesus. Bit slow defensively there. I don't know what we were doing. Switched off. Force him back. What is it? Free kick. Just wide, blimey. That wasn't that far off, I could tell. Good job I had a player on my line. <laughs> if that was on target, I don't know whether that would have gone in or not. <laughs> Flip it out. Gallagher, 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 Gallagher. Gallagher. He's got to score that. He's got to score that. He's got to score that. Oh my words. Another chance. That was Wolf. That being the back of the net. Half time wizard was gone. And boy, we needed half time, I'll say that. We needed half time. I'm thinking of I'm going to take Anderson off. He's looking a bit sus defensively and just panicking a bit. I'm going to get Chalabar on. That's, a, that's my only change I'm going to make. The B Ray Eze. Zaha. It's a good save. I don't know what Eze was doing there. Then he dribbled it into his own player. I had a bit of a problem with my camera there. But yeah, as you can see, it's 1 0. And we've got a penalty for a handball. Come on, Wilf. Come on, Zaha. 2 0. Down the middle. It's what we needed. Come on, you Palace. Oh, Gay's a bit lost there defensively. Good def oh, good save, good save. Right, I'm going to make a change. I can't be asked. I'm going to get as they all feet. We're getting tired, you know. We're getting really ropey and tired. I've only made two subs. One sub, I think. Yeah, let's get Elise on as a cam. I'm going to bring Ricky J. Jones on for Edwards. 
Lovely is Michael Elise. I don't know what Jones is doing. We're a bit lost as you can see there. So I can't do all the work for us for the love of God. Oh, Basaka, what are you doing, bro? I'm trying to chip the ball up, man. It was a bit too, got a bit too overconfident now. I'd say that. Oh, it's doing my head in. Fitter all over us, man. Oh, what the, what I'm doing out there. Jones, comfortable, comfortable save. Four time whistle, 2 0 win. Up the Palace, man. Got the win. Listen, we played a lot better in the Tottenham game than we did in like this one. Do you know what I mean? We were poor, but we won 2 0. Got the three points. And that's what I care about. Got um, Fulham now at home. Won't be an easy one in that as well. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to sit in this game and 1 2 1. The consistency showing a bit. Andreas put for the one they up in the 17th minute. Then Gallagher in the first minute of the second half. A good response from Palace after being one of that half time. Made it 1-1. So Har gets the winner after the Harry Wilson penalty miss. With 15 minutes to go, we win the game by two goals to one. Puts us to third place on 22 points, you know. Flipping out. Third place. We changed the game mode as well. I'd say that, you know what I mean? Changed it a little bit. And we're still doing well. We're still picking up points. On the way here. Same team that started... In our last three games, at home to Tottenham, away to Villa, and at home to Fulham. Not really the city ground, is it? I'm surprised I don't have it in the game, considering Nottingham Forest is history and that. Penalty. What happened? I didn't, so I, I didn't even clock that. What happened? Like a handball. God's sake, man. Really, I swear his name is for Forest. Yeah, it's a good penalty. I was. Poor for me and goal there. Or one nil down. It's really poor that. I sort of like moved before the guy even kicked the ball. Go on, Palace. Go on, Palace. Got the ball. Lovely run for Meze. What a run this is. What a run this is. Quite a remarkable run. Raksaki. Deflected. Oh, he should have scored that Edward. Come on, man. He's got to put that away. He's got to put that away. Slip there from Anderson. The clue over the slip there as well. Top save from Gaia. Yellow card for Captain Mark Gay. Edward, go on. Edward! Oh, belter. Belter. What a finish. <laughs> Ruthless finish there from Edward. He's been on fire for us in this episode and in this season and that. And in this series. You know, I'm going to make a change defensively. I'm going to take off Mark Gay and I'm going to get Chalabar on. And Anderson will be our captain. He's on a yellow though, so I've got to be careful. I've already had a couple of players sent off in this series and that. So yeah, 1-1 one, one at the break, second half just started now. All or nothing, got nothing to sort of lose, Palace. Keep it going. It's Gibbs White, he's a playmaker for Forrest. Oh, uh, Basaka, 2-1, awful defending. I mean, so open, poor defender from Basaka. Chalabal couldn't get there, he was unmarked. Keeper had no chance, so we're 2-1 down. Oh, he's through. What a save. That could have gone anywhere. It bounced so awkwardly. Lord of mercy, that could have been 3 1. Top bit of keeping, though, I'll say that. I'll give it to him. He's so sloppy. Yes, he's been awful. He's been awful. It's Marco Elise. It's a comfortable save from. Wayne Hennessy actually, Dean Henderson's not in goal for them, it's Wayne Hennessy, forgot he even played for them, I think one change and that's it, what a save guy, uh. oh, that's, that's it, that is it, we lost 2-1 and we were so poor, we were tired, oh boy, it's not good enough. Not good enough. They actually dominated us as well. Okay, so before we end this episode, we've got Wolverhampton Wanderers at home. Just going to sim one more game. Made a couple changes. I've got Chalaba in for Anderson. He's been dropped. Elise in for Rapsaki. He's been dropped. He hasn't really been on form recently. So, yeah. Hopefully, if we get a win, I'll be disappointed if we lose this game. You know what I mean? Because should be beating the likes of Wolves. And we have beaten them by two goals to nil. 
Edward scoring again inside six minutes in with what about four minutes to go. Gallagher makes it 2 0. Win has moved us up to fifth above West Ham and Chelsea on the same points as Arsenal. One, well, we're at, we're ba yeah, basically we're, we're on the same points as Arsenal. Anything can happen if we were to win and Arsenal to lose and we go above them into the top four. And that's what Brentford for the next episode. Season in the Premier League, we go to top scorers, and that's Aha is the top goal scorer in the Premier League with 13 goals. Flipping out. Edouard has got 10, he's the second top scorer, joint with Luis Diaz at third with 10. Um, forget the appearances, I want to focus on the goals, so he knows how hard for 13, Edouard with 10. Gallagher has got two goals, fair enough. Eze has only got two goals, but I don't know if more. He's not, he, he's sort of dipping a bit, Eze, you know, he's just sort of disappearing in games. But Teta has only got one, Dakura with one goal, and Luis with one goal, and that as well in the Premier League. Assist-wise, Zaha has got the, well, I lied, Eze has got six assists, he's got the most assists in that. Zaha has got four, Gallagher's got four. Raksaki's got three, you know, fair enough, he just needs a goal to his name, he hasn't even scored yet. Edwards, Mateta, Dekure, Anderson, and Elise with one each. Ricky J. Jones, he went, once he gets his time to shine and that, if we have any injuries, or I decide to put him in the one Premier League game, I'm sure we get a few goals. And yeah, make sure to like, share, subscribe, any opinions, comments, new signings for January, any tactical changes, and any changes and that within the team, feel free to put in the comment section down below. See you on my next video in a bit.